we have a, an analogy we use around here called conductor and composer. And in a traditional system, a teacher is asked to both compose curriculum and conduct it kind of in the same, at the same time. Um, we don't do that. We actually divide those. Those are different skills, and a good conductor does not necessarily make a good composer, and a good composer does not necessarily make a good conductor. Um, but here, when you start, you become a conductor first. Can you facilitate the curriculum? Can you bring this curriculum to life for the student and start to individualize it? That's hard enough. So once you get that down and you've taught in our model for a little bit, you'll get to understand the instructional design process. And then you can join a curriculum design team, which we call a CDT.